Hello, my name is Natalie Rowan. Every time I cross the bridge into North Wildwood, I get such a feeling of joy. It's a feeling of coming home. I spent the summers of my youth sunbathing on the beaches, hanging out at the arcades on the boardwalk, and riding bikes throughout the island. One of my favorite places back in the day was Sportland Pool. Just thinking of it makes me feel like a kid again. When the days were carefree and we lived in bathing suits and bare feet. My brothers and sisters and I would hop on our swim bikes in the morning and wave goodbye to our mom as we set off on a day of adventure at the pool. There was always an army of cousins that would tag along as well. The more the merrier. Sportland Pool had a high dive that for a young girl seemed intimidating. But I can remember the feeling of accomplishment the first time I summoned up the courage to hang my toes over the edge, hold my nose, and take the plunge. When lunchtime came, we would walk down the boardwalk to Nathan's Hot Dogs, being sure to get the invisible ink stamps on our hands so that we could gain re-entry into the pool for the afternoon. I remember the really cool bandstand at the back of the pool and the jukebox playing our favorite tunes. One Sunday afternoon, my dad took us to the pool and played some tunes, one that I will always remember, the Rolling Stones singing Satisfaction. To this day, when I hear that song, I am a young girl with her dad sitting on the bleachers at Sportland Pool. In the evenings, we would watch the actors jumping on the trampoline that was in front of Sportland Pool, enticing people to come in to see the aqua show. I was a more timid child, but not my sister Sharon. She would love to volunteer to go on the float in the middle of the pool and joust with the entertainers, only to wind up in the water again. I think she secretly wanted to be josted into the water so she could cool off from those hot summer nights. The show always culminated in one of the entertainers climbing up to the tippy top of the super high platform. With great anticipation, we would wait and watch as they performed the perfect swan dive to end the show. Wildwood, the beaches, the boardwalk, and Sportland Pool will always be etched in my memory as a reminder of how blessed I was as a child to have parents who bought a shore home, the McMonicles shore home, right here in this very beach at 7th Street since 1968.